All right, hey guys, OFD checking in here, and tonight we're going to be taking a look at a watch from Nomos Watch Company. Now, Nomos is what I'd consider to be a newer watch company. They've been around since 1990, so not a lot of rich heritage, but in that short amount of time, Nomos has really uh, garnered a lot of attention with their amazingly beautiful Bauhaus-style watches, uh, amazing in-house creations, the movements. Um, they're just done really, really well, and in the last, I'd say, five to ten years they really really have become popular so i have today the 38 millimeter orion to take a look at i want to thank chris over at marshall time for sending this watch over to take a look at so let's go ahead and check it out now like i said it's a 38 millimeter orion so it's 38 millimeters on this case from side to side not including the crown you have 47.8 millimeters lug to lug is what i measured so basically 48 millimeters from lug to lug which makes this watch wear very well if you're concerned with the 38 side to side that longer lug length really makes this watch wear well one of the other things that makes it wear well is the fact that it's only nine millimeters thick to the top of the sapphire crystal the case shape also helps in the comfort of this watch 19 millimeter lug opening on the watch so it's going to be a little bit selective on the bands but this cordovan leather strap that they come on is beautiful now this is a used watch that um, chris picked up recently and i again i want to thank him for sending it out but very very nice i do believe this is a 2017 model i'm going to bring it up here a little closer so you guys can see this uh, white silver dial on the watch which is just absolutely beautiful now these are offered in a number of different colorways I really think this white one just really, really stands out. And I'm going to kind of tilt it at an angle here so you can see the gold shine on those indices at the five-minute marks, which is a, just a classy, classy touch. And also, when you get it to an angle just right, you can see with a little bit of reflection from the lights, you can see the blue of those uh, thermally blued hands on the watch. Really, really a spectacular thing to see on this watch. I love the way that's done. A small seconds down there, uh, just above six o'clock, also has that fire blued or that thermally blued hand on it. And you can see there is a nice texturing to that sub dial on the watch. The smooth sweep of that second hand is uh, due to the fact that this is running the in house, uh, completely in house alpha movement from Nomos. This is a 17 joule movement, hand winding movement. And when I flip over the watch here, we'll take a look at the back of it and check it out. But take a look at the case polishing on the watch, guys. Again, I'm going to bring it up a little bit closer so you can see it's done extremely, extremely well. The case polishing is very sharp, very nicely done. Everything is polished, I do believe, on the case of this watch. No brushing whatsoever. But for a dress watch, with this, which this definitely is, it really, really shines and looks nice. You do have the Nomos there on the uh, little crown. Very hard to see. And it's nice to see that they've put the pierced lugs on this watch also. Forgive me for the fingerprints. Now, guys, I'm going to go ahead and flip it over here, and we'll take a look at the, the case back. Now, this has the optional sapphire case back on the watch which is a domed sapphire crystal also you can see the beautiful dome to that you can get the solid stainless um, case back on this watch honestly I don't know why you would want to do that because the movement on this watch is just absolutely beautiful bring it up here a little closer again an in-house movement from Nomos uh, if you're not familiar Nomos is also based out of Glaus Schut, which is the heart of the German watch making industry you know it's be between uh dresden and berlin there in the mountain areas and it's been for the last 175 years really the heart of german watchmaking gives you the inst uh, the information on the back of the watch here um, i'm not going to try to even pronounce any of that right there definitely in german but lets you know this is the orion model and that it has 30 meters of water resistance obviously it's a dress watch so you're not going to swim with this one so Let's go ahead and pause it for just a minute and get this watch on my 7-inch wrist. All right, so here's the watch on my 7-inch wrist. And although 38 might sound kind of small, side-to-side uh, -side minus the crown, it really isn't given the lug length on this watch. Coming in at almost 48 millimeters, you can see the watch really fits the wrist. The shell cordovan leather strap is just very, very comfortable. This one, of course, is broken in because it's a used watch that, that uh, Chris picked up. And you have the Nomos logo there on the polished buckle of the watch. Now, since I have it here, I wanted to show you guys the way this infor the, the watch has come. Here's your information you get in a package here. Gives you the purchase information, all the warranty card and whatnot inside of there. They come with their polishing cloth, which is very nice. And then you have this very, very nicely done wooden box here. 
has a little push button to open it and you open it up and that's the way the watches are presented. And this is actually a really uh, wooden box, so pretty nice. Uh, the price point on the Nomos, uh, this particular model, the Orion, these start around $2,200. You can find them at quite good bargains on the secondary market, so go ahead and look around out there. But I really like what Nomos does. They're very classy watches, very, very well done watches. And uh, I think they're something that if you do own one, you should be proud to own it because they just, you know, as far as being out of Glashut, uh, Germany, it is the, like I said, the heart of German watchmaking and the watches uh, have a rich history behind them. So, all right, guys, this has been the Nomos Orion. Uh, very beautiful watch. Thanks again to Chris at Marshall Time for sending it over here to check out. Like the video, give me a thumbs up down there at the bottom. And if you've not subscribed to the OFG channel yet, please do. Please do. Thanks, guys.